The Prodigal Son This is the story of a man who had large fields, cattle, and much abundance. He also had two sons who lived with him. The eldest worked hard with effort. And the youngest, well, not so much. One day, he came to his father and said, Dad, I need you to give me my inheritance money. The father hesitated, but finally gave him his share. And so, with his pockets full, he said goodbye, leaving his home and family behind. Arriving in the city with his ego and his money, caught the attention of the people who kindly received him. People turn to see and greet the foreigner. But not everyone had the best of intentions. Money brought him new friends and opened doors that he couldn't refuse. Without thinking too much about it, he began to enjoy all the pleasures he could afford. Very soon, he found himself surrounded by people interested in what he had. Oh yeah! Being the center of attention is what he enjoyed, but he forgot that in the end, everything has its cost. And so, he spent his days and weeks living from party to party, wasting his money and his life. Our friend was a little shocked when he found out that his money no longer existed. And then, he was kindly invited to leave.
But money was not the only thing he would lose. His friends would leave him too. Finally, he realized that without wealth or dignity, he was no longer welcome in that city. And then, he had no choice but to ask for a job on a nearby farm. noticed that even the pigs ate better than him. Hungry and humiliated, our friend began to meditate on his mistakes. He began to miss his home, his loving father, and also the bread on the table. But what saddened him the most was having failed his father. And then he thought, maybe he will forgive me. Taking courage, he returned home not knowing how he would be received. The father's face lit up when he saw his beloved son. And he ran to receive him with great joy. Father, the boy said, I have sinned against heaven and against you. I do not deserve to be your son. Lifting him up, the father shows him love and forgives him. And so, with joy, the prodigal son was welcomed back to his home. The next day, the father and his assistants prepared a great feast. But not everyone was happy. The eldest son felt a little jealous. Father, your son has taken your money and wasted it on parties and alcohol! Calmly, he answered, Son, you're always with me, and what is mine is yours. But your brother was dead and lost, and he has returned. Understanding this, the older brother receives the younger. And so, they finally celebrate together the return of the prodigal son. Based on the book of Luke, chapter 15, verses 11 to 32. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more stories.